Hello, welcome to Kent Beer Reviews. Right, a very kind of easily available beer here in the UK. Um, it's one of the kind of mainstream real ale breweries that have been going a long time. Anyway, this beer is from the Griffin Brewery, Fuller's London Pride. Bitter, coming in at 4.7% ABV. Um, in their traditional Griffin Brewery bottle, easily available on, on cask, especially down down this part of the country. So there's their bottle cap for this brew. Kind of probably well known, certainly in America, and probably other parts of the world. I've had this beer a fair while. It needs to be drunk. I'm going to go through a lot of my old beers I've had quite a long time. So um, I've only got one or two Kent beers at the moment. The rest are all kind of beers, real ales. Um, I've got a fair few um, craft beers as well, so keep me going for a while. But I need to clear the fridge. So beer in a glass. Try and generate a bit of head here. Just. Uh, it's not bottle conditioned, so leave a bit of room for my big nose. It's a finger of just off white head, very clear, very, very clear. When I first tried this beer, oh, how long ago now? Probably 10 years ago, something like that. I thought it was an absolutely amazing beer. Um, what I can remember of it, it was. Anyway, I'm not going to spoil it too much, but I thought it was fantastic. Be interesting to see how my palate's changed, what I think of this beer now anyway. Lovely looking beer, gentle carbonation. Nice kind of mm, coppery, maho light mahogany colour, but very clear. I can see straight through it. Very clear indeed. It's getting aroma then. Kind of a biscuity, bready malt. Maybe some bit sort of cracker, dry cracker, or something like that. Hedgerow kind of fruits, noisy road, the other side of you. Smells nice. Light fruits. Let's give it a try. Cheers. It's quite a um, fruit. Some uh, maybe some red currants. Um, there's a slight dryness, dry, dry hop. Um, yeah, it's got some lovely qualities. It's got that kind of biscuity, bready malt build at the right of the front. Leaving a decent lacing. It's got a nice tang to it. It leaves on the palate. Uh, maybe some, maybe some apples. Um, yeah, hedgerow fruits. More kind of floral in the hop kind of department. The hops in this beer are um, Target, Challenger, and North Down. So. It's what it says, London Pride has a smooth, distinctive multi base with a rich balance of well developed hop uh, flavours from Target, Challenger, North Down varieties and our own unique yeast in the brew. Every brewery seems to have a unique yeast. Um, that was me, that bit. No, it doesn't say there. An impressively complex beer. The UK, UK's favourite premium, premium ale. I hate that kind of premium stuff. 
Um, best before the 24th of October 2016. Brewed beside the Thames since 1845, so they've been going over a long time. Fuller's London Pride. There's the information there. If you want to pause it, this is in a 500ml bottle. So, a pint. I think it's a pint, something like that. Nice tangy beer. Nice malt base. Lighter fruits, hedgerows, as I said. Nice. It's nice beer. Um, it's a regular kind of real ale, UK real ale. So as for a rating then for Fuller's London Pride, I will give that a 7 out of 10. That's a 7 out of 10 from me. If you've had this beer before, you've managed to get it in America, let us know what you think as well. Um, or anywhere else outside the UK, be good to know what you think of it. Um, yeah, nice. Back to my roots kind of beer. Anyway, cheers for watching. I'll see you next review. Cheers.